Hi. So today we're actually put, look at that house. It's so big. We're actually gonna be playing a new game that was uh, just put into pre-alpha like not too long ago. It's called Into the Flames. Um, it looks kind of cool. There's lots of stuff. There's a house that's currently on fire, so we should probably go do something about that. So let's go ahead and do that. It took me a second to figure out all the controls because well, I'm kind of retarded. So. See if we can get this house no longer on fire. Break the door. Break the door, asshole. You are taking way too long. Break the door. Oh, do you hold? Uh, did it a second ago. Yo, can I just ninja kick this bullshit? I'm just like spamming buttons now. Seriously? Door. Come on, dude. I literally did this two seconds ago, and now it's just going to kick my ass because it's rude. It's 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 because it's on camera. Oh, there it is. Sweet. I swear. It was easier a minute ago. So let me put that back. Oh, also, on the radio menu, it's kind of funny. There's a revolver and a shotgun. I don't know if you're supposed to shoot the fire out. Actually, I know that it's. it's there are buttons that do that, but it just made me laugh that there's a shotgun and a revolver. This dude's slow, run faster. There's shit on fire. Stuff to be done. Get all that fire. Let's go ahead and do some stuff, shall we? Do I have a do I have health menu that requires a Doesn't look like it. Dude, this room is a lot involved in fire. Oh, it does affect you. Shit. Oh. Well. Oh. Sweet. I just respawned. That's convenient. Because I'm probably going to die a lot. Because I don't know what the mask button is. And I didn't care to learn. Because, well, why would I learn things? Let's try not to die this time. BC. M. M is for mask. I like these controls because they're smart enough for me to be able to figure out. Yo, your air goes down hella quick. Oh, you still get injured if you go in, if you actually end up on fire. That, that makes fucking sense. If you're actually on fire, you get hurt. Don't end up on fire again, bud. What? What? Oh, am I out of water on the truck? Shit. Oh. Yep, so... Something that was really cool, uh, these lights, hold on, there's like a lot of trucks here that I can just take away off something else. The lights here, like, matter. So if I do this, and then this, or G, F, ah, and then E, I need the hydrant wrench, and I do stuff. I like how it's a Bluetooth hydrant connection, it's kind of funny. The, uh, the dev's pretty cool. He, uh, he did tell me that there was a couple of little issues. But it's fine. It's new. New stuff is fun. I also like the, the Bluetooth hydrant connection. It just makes me laugh. I don't know why. Like, because I'm seven. Put water on fire. This is kind of cool. I'm kind of super excited to see how far this can go. He's got a lot of uh, other stuff you can do with it, or other things like kind of planned. It looks like like he's got ladder truck models and stuff like that. So I can't wait to be able to roll a ladder truck in multiple games. That's gonna be fun because we all know that I'm just gonna crash the shit out of whatever I end up driving. Unfortunately, you can't drive anything right now, but it, it won't. It, it's probably for the best for the citizens of whatever this town's going to be called that I can't drive, but, you know. Oh, fire. Oh, no. I don't know what over budget means, aside from out of money. This is, well, like I was saying, this is the uh, only real thing you can do right now is just uh, this one house fire, but it's still pretty cool. And it looks like 
in some of the screenshots I was looking at, there are destructible roofs and stuff. So just like uh, other games, you can oh, you just hold the water on it until it goes out. What a concept! I for some reason I thought if you got closer, it would make a difference. But it doesn't. Gotcha. Um. Yeah, it looks like there's destructible ceilings and stuff, so you can hook the ceiling and do all that stuff. I will check that out before I'm done, if I remember, because we all know I don't remember basically anything. Because I have a memory of a worm. This dude is fighting the hell out of some fire. For as involved as this house was, it's good that, like, Gravity isn't a or the, like realistic house physics isn't the thing because this shit would be on the ground. Like this, this would have burnt all the way through, and we'd be we'd be staring at a foundation. This new house is just burned ridiculously fast. Kind of sad. Thank you. Oh, that's kind of cool. Yo, that's a that's a feature we need in like Call of Duty. You can switch what shoulder you're going over. I like that. I don't know if I like that because my life up until this point has been third person or first person shooters. And I hate third person shooters. But, oh, is there a Mustang burning? Oh no, it's like a Ford Focus. Or like a, it's like a Saturn piece of shit. I don't know what kind of car that is, but it's not a Lost. It's not a cool one. Yeah, this this camera situation is pretty cool. I really like that. I don't really know where that idea came from, but I like it. Oh, the skateboard's on fire! Dude, we gotta get the skateboard out. Some total Tony Hawk wannabes in KS100 find that the skateboard is on fire. Garage is out. Oh, you don't have to hold it. I'm dumb. I've been holding it, the spray button this whole time. I thought it mattered. It doesn't. Kind of good to know. Oof. I'm not even sure what's burning up here. Just everything. But you can also play this multiplayer. It's just none of my friends are online right now because they're weird. Just go to bed before you know ten o'clock on a Thursday. You have to think of what day it was. I mean. One thing that always bothers me about firefighting video games is how much water it takes to put out fire. I mean, I know it's a video game, but steam conversion exists. Well, I mean, there is an ass load of fire. So, who knows? God damn it. Well, who didn't see that one coming? At least it's, it's more out than it was when I died last time. We're making progress. It's in the attic too, like you can see the fire in the attic. It's kind of dope. Yeah, you can like throw ladders and stuff. I don't know if I'm gonna get there yet. It's a really smoky environment. Oh! Jumpy. I also like how it's not a constant. It's he does he moves around as he stands. He doesn't just stand in one spot and spray. So he kind of sprays all over the places he's standing around. I don't know why that makes me happy, but it does. Next room.
This is where it'd be nice to have a friend to be able to um, hook ceiling and do stuff like that. But he's cool. I take care of it a lot. One man firefight army right here, man. It does look like there's a little bit of fire in the attic, so we saw have to pull some ceiling. Fine by me. By all the things. Also, it says there's a saw in the game, so you can also probably do some ventilation, but we'll see. Bathroom out. Save the shitter. I think it's just this last room. This is a weird house setup. Oh, no, 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 no. Don't be on fire. Good of you. There we go. Get that out. Oh, bro, the mattress is on fire. Everything's on fire. Well, soon to not be on fire. Because I'm awesome. As I crack all of my fingers. Very interesting. It has like three stages. Stage one, stage two, stage three. I'm about to find out if I drop the hose. F. Is it E? No, it just stays with me. Okay. There's obviously fire in the attic, so I gotta do something about that. Oh, wait a sec. I got this. Through. I like how the hose just follows me around now. Oh, that's cool. Little zigzag. Uh, nope, not control it. P. That button. Shotgun. Gauge is pipe bolt. Okay, so gauge is on the tower. Gauge. Oh, I have to get rid of this. Shenanigans! Wish I could just put it down. Oops. That's awesome. I'll do some ceiling pulling. Yo, this dude is fighting fire without gloves on. That is, that is not, oh, P. Gauge. This dude doesn't have gloves on. That's, that's just not smart. Like, I mean, obviously he doesn't have a mask on, so probably this, the dumbest thing. But he definitely doesn't have gloves on. Let's see, look at that. This is pretty awesome. Fire up there. Fire maybe up there. Kill it. Oh, there's fire in this room. Ah, this. Oh, hell. So I'm gonna go outside, grab the... This is cool. I like this. Oh, I missed. How did I miss... How did you miss the ceiling, bro? Bro. How did you miss the ceiling? What is wrong with you? Yeah. There's fire up there. Fire up here too. Oh, there's fire up here too, dude. This whole attic is on fire. That's not good. Fucking, fucking stop missing the ceiling, dude. You know you belong on the engine company when you can't even find the ceiling to hook. You just stab at the air. Cool. So let's go out, grab the hose again. Put the rest of this fuego out. And we'll be good. This dude runs so slowly. It makes me sad. Yeah. 
F. Going faster, my man. This is a very cool game for being pre-alpha or whatever. Whatever current, I think it's pre-alpha. is a technical term of technical state of development right now. I think that's what the download said. Yeah, I will uh, put a link in the description to this dude's Discord, or the game's Discord. Well, the game, kind of same thing. Because um, that's kind of, looks like the best way to find all the information to this and keep it current. I would just post the demo link, but it's not currently on Steam. I don't really know what the plans are for that yet. But it's not currently on Steam. And I just downloaded it off of the Google Drive. So I'll just link this the Discord to this game. I might be too far from this Fuego. And uh, it seems like the best way to play it. This is pretty cool. It's definitely going to be worth keeping an eye on to see what where it all goes. That fire, fire does not want to go out. I might not be in the right spot for it. It'll be very interesting to see where all this goes. It's really cool being able to like crash fire trucks and stuff in multiple, multiple games. That's all I ever wanted in life is to crash fire trucks in video games. I put water through the yo. I put water through the drywall. Uh, I might not be doing anything. I might not get all this fire out, guys. I don't feel like running back down and grabbing more things. Give it another shot. I say I'm right under it. That should do it. I had it there for a second. Come in. The fire doesn't really want to go out. Oh, there it goes. And this, maybe. I'm shooting through drywall, though. Maybe if my friends wanted to play, we'd be able to do it. Check out in the other room. I like the trail of hose I just leave everywhere. Beautiful. I got the fire out. I did the thing. Still a lot of smoke. And then, hold on. I know what I'm going to do now. I have a plan. Aside from drag hose throughout this lovely person's house. Oh, that's kind of funny. It's doing inchworm things. I can appreciate that. I like the inchworm hose. And then, I have a plan. Shock, shocking saw. Oh, that's not what I wanted. I read it and I still grabbed the wrong one. Put it rest mirror. How do I put how do I use Ah oh, damn it? Oh yeah. That fan sounds hella broken. Yo, that fan sounds like it is not doing super hot. Good old proximity uh sounds though. But yeah! So this is, uh, like I said, it's called Into the Flames. I might have said Inside the Flames because I have Inside the Fire by the Sturp stuck in my head. But it's called Into the Flames. I'll put a link to their Discord in the description because that's where, how I found out about it through a random, random dude sending me a link to it, which was awesome. I don't remember what the dude's name is. I can find it real quick. M. Morgan sent me the link to the game. I was like, this looks kind of neat. So yeah, 
I'll put a link in the description, and yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed, because I'll probably be playing this a fair amount more, because it's, you know, continue getting better. So yeah, hope you have a good day. Bye.